saw this fly at the Camarillo Air Show. It was amazing. Uh, you know, the audience had never seen anything like that in the West. You know, except for, as I said, the, the guys that were 80-something that knew Sammy Mason and were involved in the Lockheed test program. <laughs> I, I don't even know what to say. I mean, I could obviously call it, but... Let the sound of the helicopter do the talking. I'm not a helicopter expert and don't profess to be, but I'm guessing that that, that helicopter is running on a uh, semi-rigid rotor system is how they get the performance out of that. <laughs> yeah, when, when what always gets me about that is just once again, as I said, how easy he can make it look. God, is this a great sky or what? Oh, this is beautiful. Thank you, Jack. Can't believe it. All right, now he's going to finish with a backflip. There we go. <laughs> oh, and by the way, when Chuck comes here, he's going to circle and come to a hover. He's the guy who looks like a surfer with the long blonde hair and a mustache. You expect to see some crew cut guy get out of this machine, and it's not. Chuck is going to go ahead and say goodbye. What's great about this is he can see all of you. Now that, that is so cool. That is one of the coolest acts I've ever talked about, announced, or even been around. And on top of it, a very nice guy. You're one of the jumper dudes. You did a great job, bud. You really did. Great job. What's happening? This is my friend Ben. Ben, tell us a little about yourself. I was a B-29 pilot in World War II. Three years before that in the Army Air Corps as an instructor, World War um, I flew 35 missions against the home islands of Japan from the Marianas. Uh, I had a lot of fun. Excellent. <laughs> What's with uh, Warren here? Tell us about Warren. About four well, years, three or four uh, Warren, years in Thailand. Uh, Thailand we, the we understand that you were a yep. mess officer for 20 a years. Well, no. it, was, it was basically a mess, but... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was a bad tell boy. Tell him about yourself. I, 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 um, I, I tried to do the best I can. Yeah, you Nebby could. We always do. Last <laughs> pass, and, and, um, and now we're going to, that was Dave Benoni, and now uh, we're going to two years in Bill Thailand. Right and, and now in normal phenom. routine, he and does a on. ground start. With five women. What we don't want here was it six or you told me a five. is a ground well, stuff. Well, this a five or a so Bill's going to get this airplane up in the air. He's out of well, we, my we had show of fun 230. There. We, we did... Um, we, and I'm going to assume he's going to grab some altitude. In the Thai... If he, um, he'll do. If he's going to do what I think he'll do, he'll go ahead like the, 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 and uh, start with inverted the flat spin. Water festival. And you, can you can tell he's a little confused about all of this. It's all that Thai stuff. <laughs> I'm not sober enough. <laughs> See, he, he's talking about these Thai women. When right. I was in the Pacific, all we had were Red Cross girls. Hey, at least they can oh, supply a little... That's a different issue. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You see, he, he's like he, you are. Bill from years he's of 30 years the younger than I am. Uh, oh, there we go. Those of you who don't know much about Bill's bio, we're, I'll keep it short. Fun, I the full Air Force career, United career. 
A lot of fun. He did a, a lot of fun in Thailand. Oh, he bet. from the left seat. He went and took the side <laughs> saddle for another. <laughs> Thank you.